Well, I'm here. Hurrah. Right. Um, I've got to sort out all my SD cards and upload all my footage. And then uh, I'm going to settle down for the night because it's about half past eight now. So, um, love a like, guys. Hope you enjoyed the journey so far. And um, see you in the morning. Good morning. <laughs> That's my lay boy. This morning. Ooh, last night. Um, yeah, it's quite a nice night. Actually, I had a good night. I was slightly on the uh, slopage here last night, so I nearly fell out of bed. Anyway, um, I'm going to visit a couple of places on my way this morning, so um, let's get underway. Continue for half a mile. I think my set 
now she's been smoking. I've been out on the been out on the pedal the night before. <laughs> the voice changes. I don't know why. Let's go out and have a look. We're out. <laughs> um, I'm wondering if there used to be some sort of ferry here, because uh, actually you won't be able to see. Over there, there's um, is where the other end of this road goes. You sort of come down here, along here, and then it comes out over there, <laughs> which is a bit weird. So maybe this was a Ford or something, I don't know, but it's beautiful here. It's so peaceful. Um, little boats, look. This is, um, this is obviously all tidal along here. Um, the tar as you, you can see, the tide comes up right up to the wall. God, it's lovely, isn't it? Wow. I can't remember what river that is. River or something. <laughs> look, there's a little seat here, look. A little seat you can sit on. Sit and watch the tide coming in, look. Beautiful, isn't it? Look, it's an old anchor there. See the anchor? Huge great thing. No parking turning area. Oh, whoops. <laughs> okay, well, I'll do this quick. I'll do this video and then I'll I'll move. <laughs> I'll go and park up there. Yeah, I just didn't see that. I'll have to do that in a minute. Attention all users. Yeah, all right. Well, I won't park there then. I'll have to move. Actually, well, I can't move in. There's nowhere to move, is there? Well, not really. Well, I could park up there, I suppose. I was going to have a cup of tea, but I won't bother now. I'll just move on. So, Toy Times. Someone's restoring there. Look at that massive old house in there. Must have been an old manor house or something. Typical, isn't it? Somebody coming down now. Old anchor. What does it say over here then? I didn't see a parking sign. <laughs> Launch recovery at high tide, one to three hours. Plus, oh, plus minus three hours. Wow. Look at it. It's flipping beautiful, isn't it? Isn't it nice? So idyllic. Beautiful. I know it says no, it says turn in circle, but I didn't see the, I didn't see the sign. <laughs> I 
the thing is I'll have to move and I, don't, I think I've got a nice spot there. <laughs> I'm not really blocking anybody, am I? And you look, there's, there's plenty enough for them to turn around there, isn't there? Right, let's um, do have a cup of tea. Hope I don't slip down because it's really slippery. And um, then we'll get back underway again. Right, I'm going to drink this up and then um, we're going to head off to uh, Broadhaven. So. See you in a minute. Right, drunk me cup of tea. Let's go to Broadhaven. Let's go. It wasn't long until I got to Haverford West. I went through the town and headed on the outward road out towards Broadhaven. I don't have the in-facing GoPro on at the moment, so enjoy the ride for a little while and uh, I'll catch up with you shortly. Everywhere though, everywhere is getting spoilt with building now. This was quite a nice little place. Um, as to whether it is, I don't know. Or, 
whether it's been molested with housing and uh, the um, corporate what's it? Yeah, this little shed here on the left, the bus shelter. Um, we used to have a, a friend that used to own the house in there, um, and they used to rent it out for holidays. We used to go there quite a lot. When, um, in a quarter of a mile, your was destination will be on the right. Switch that off. We had uh, we had a few bed and breakfasts here as well. Oh my God! Look at the car park. It's packed. <laughs> There's a campsite just there. Right, let's go in the car park. And uh, we'll park up. Turn right towards Melmore Way, B4341, then make a U turn. Yeah, shut up. I don't want to make a U turn, I'm here. <laughs> Stupid people. We are here. I'm tucked in the corner. And um I've paid me parking. It's Ellie. <laughs> yeah. Ellie wants to go on the beach, don't you Ellie? My battery's getting very low if it hasn't gone already. Oh well. I've got a spare one in my pocket. Um, yeah, just waiting for um, waiting for the rest of the family to turn up. Well, two of them. <laughs> They're coming with some friends, so uh, we're going to go for a little walk on the beach. So, me and Ellie, me and Ellie, <laughs> me and Ellie. See you in a minute. One way. Hmm? Right, we're meeting the family, or oh, I've got to pick them up to get some back, whatever. Right, let's go, let's go and have a quick look at the issues. Trip me up, no. I'm gonna have a quick look on the seafront. Right, let's go and have a look. Come on. Ooh, been doing some building in there. I still haven't finished yet. Still building. <laughs> God, they've been building in that plot for years. They were doing that f about five, six years ago. It was years ago we came here last. Our exhibition. But the beach is busy. Oh, they've actually built a new garage, look. That's new. What have we got then? Oh, we've got Broadhaven. Yeah, here we go, look. There's the old hotel there. I think that's gone now, I think they knocked it down. September no dogs look so um yes don't come here in the summer because there's no point no speech I'll go down here I was too busy too many people come on oh it's packed look at it look at all the people down there oh we've got, we got the relatives down there look We've got a van full, so we've got to go back to have a west now. Right. Well, there's um, there's Broadhaven. A bit busy for my liking. So we'll um, see you in the mode. Change of plan. Um, I'm back at the car park. Um, I'm now taking the family back to Haverford West. 
um, because they got a lift here but their lift can't take them back so I'm taking them back to have a rest um, they've now decided to stay on the beach for another hour <laughs> so now I'm sat in the car park for an hour because my parking tickets already ran out so um, I'm gonna have to sit here and wait till they come back and then I can get underway to St David's um, no idea when I'm going to be able to film again so um, yeah managed to drop the family off and um, I managed to get away um, you find me now on my way to St David and I am now near Newgale Sands and um, let's follow the rest of the journey The funniest part of this bit of the video is uh, that there's no audio from the camera, unfortunately, because um, it got damaged. Anyway, um, <laughs> what I can remember of this one is me just saying no. No, no, no. Basically because there's too many people. Um, I don't do busy. I don't do overpopulated. But um, this was a very nice place. But I wouldn't want to stay there. There's a footpath just here on the left, on this corner, which uh, takes you along the coast path to our next destination, which is Solva. This is Solva now, the little village we're uh, entering now. It's basically pretty much one road that runs right the way through. Uh, it's split into two parts. It's more of an upper Solva and a lower Solva. This obviously being the lower Solva. Um, this little village is at the mouth of the River Solver. Um, and there's a nice little sort of harbour where um, people tend to keep their boats. And uh, it's a very picturesque little village. And it's got some nice little restaurants too. Um, I do actually do a walk here um, tomorrow. Um, I'll be walking from the campsite and uh, I shall be meeting up with um, my little lad and his granddad who uh, are going to walk from Newgale. lovely little Welsh villages are great but um, they do suffer from holiday traffic um, generally a lot of the time the roads are uh, well can be single tracked um, when you go through some of these small villages you can uh, especially at peak times um, this obviously was filmed during a bank holiday weekend so uh, there were lots of people and uh, you did get the odd one that had a caravan and um, it was a bit of a squeeze to get through breathe in For 
From here we have to travel about another three and a half miles and then we eventually are going to reach our destination which is St David's. changed a little from the last time I came here they'd uh, put in a large roundabout and uh, they'd done the road on the right which used to be a country lane um, looks like they've opened it up for larger traffic now right we're gonna hang a left down here and uh, we're going to head into our campsite which we've booked for two nights there we go Gladney Mall this is where we're going this is where we're staying I've got to walk all up here. <laughs> nice view, well actually it's a bit, well I think there is a nice view, it's just a bit hazy. Is it up through there? Yeah, is it? follow the road round. Right. Okay? Yeah, lovely job, thanks. There we are, how about that then? It's a happy field isn't it? Oh, that one. Oh. 